killing of George Floyd one year ago sparked sadness and anger. Massive protests launching a national conversation about racial injustice and police reform. I think we're at a watershed moment in American policing. Fired Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin was found guilty on all three murder and manslaughter charges. But on the anniversary of Floyd's death, substantial change in policing has been slow to come. President Biden has called on the Senate to follow the House and pass the George Floyd Justice in Policing Act. Let's get it done next month. By the first anniversary of George Floyd's death. The legislation would ban chokeholds and no-knock warrants, set up a national registry of police misconduct, and overhaul qualified immunity, a legal doctrine that shields law enforcement from civil lawsuits. Critics say it shields officers from accountability. We have 18,000 police departments and no national standards. Under pressure after Floyd's death, police departments across the nation began reviewing their procedures, training, and hiring. We gotta look at past practices, what's not working anymore? Congress will not meet the president's deadline to pass the Floyd Act by the anniversary of his death. Talks continue as lawmakers say getting real reform is more important than rushing to meet a target date. Karen Travers, ABC News, Washington.